Chango game. The game of Chango is a game played where two people play against each other. One of them wins and the other loses. There is no draws. There are no drawn Chango games. 12 players participate in a Chango championship. They were divided into four groups. Group A is Aruna, Azul and Arif. Group B, Brinda, Bridge and Biju. Group C, Chitra, Chetan and Chavi. And Group D, Dipen, Donna and Deb. So A, B, C, D at least the names are consistent starting with A, B, C, D. But I hate this because I have to write down Aruna, Azul and Arif, all starting with A. I will get confused between the names. I should be very careful. Players within each group had a distinct rank going into the championship. The players have not been listed necessarily according to their ranks. A usual pattern. In the group stage of the game, the second and third rank players play against each other. The winner of that game plays against the first rank player of the group. The winner of this second game is considered as the winner of the group and enters a semi-final. So there are Z1, Z2, Z3. If Z1 are the top rank, these two will play. Whoever wins will play with Z1. Whoever wins will qualify for the semi-final. The winners from groups A and B play against each other in the semi-final. While well, the winners from C and D play against each other in the other semi-final. The winners of the two semi-finals play against each other in the final to decide the winner of the championship. Nice. It is known that Chitra did not win the championship, which is nice. Which is not nice for Chitra. Simple fact. Aruna did not play against Arif. Bridge did not play against Brinda. Did not play. I don't like it. Aruna did not play against Arif. Aruna versus Arif was not a match. It doesn't help us draw any inference powerfully from there. We cannot say neither of them was number one. Because uh, Aruna could have been number one. Arif could have played against, played with um, Azur and lost. So this will hold good. It was not, not giving us much. Aruna, Biju, Chitra and Dipen played three games each. Azul and Chetan played two games each. And the remaining played one game each. This is a big giveaway. These four people played three games each. From a group, you could play one game. If you are the seeded player, you play one game. The number one player, you play one game. Or two games. There are one group game or two group games. If you are playing three games, then you have come outside the group. Or you have won the group and you have taken part in the semi-finals. So Aruna, Biju, Chitra and Dipen, automatically we know that they have played the semi-finals. They have gone to the next round, which is huge. Aruna, Biju, Chitra and Dipin played three games each. Within a group, you can play against two and three could play a game and then the winner will play against one. So within the group, the top ranked player will play one game. The guy who wins the first round will play two games. The guy who loses the first round will play one game. Right? So, so if you play three games, then you play the game outside of your group, which automatically means the semi-finals are Aruna, Biju, Chitra, and Dipen. Nice. Azul and Chetan played two games each. Azul played two and Chetan played two, which is very interesting. They did not qualify, that means they got eliminated. Ah, and I can straight away say Azul played with Arif, won that match, qualified to play against Aruna lost that match. So I know in this group, we had an Azul versus Arif, which Azul won, and then an Azul versus Aruna, that Aruna won. Likewise, Chetan had a very similar issue. He played two games. That means Chetan versus Chavi, Chetan won. And Chetan versus Chitra, that Chitra one, which is nice, beautiful. This also tells us that in this group, Aruna was the seeded player, number one ranked. And this group, Chitra was ranked number one. Brilliant. So we've carved out two groups, group games, very nicely. Aruna is number one, Chitra is number one. Azul vs Arif, which Azul won. Azul vs Aruna, that Azuna won. Chetan vs Chavi, that Chetan won. Chitra vs Chetan vs Chitra, that Chitra won. Now, Aruna has played three games. Chitra has played three games. What does that tell us? Aruna plays one game here with Azul. The second game with Biju. 
if she loses that she's going home or aruna versus biju aruna has won chitra versus dipen chitra has won the finals has been played between aruna and chitra which is also very interesting because now this comes into play chitra did not win the championship that means aruna versus chitra the winner in that is aruna not chitra right now let's build on this let's come back to this this one we have not really used aruna did not play against arif that we have already used simple inference we know that bridge did not play against brinda biju qualified to win so biju won a match bridge did not play against brinda so biju is not number 1 because he qualified but he did, the other two did not play each other so bridge did not play against brinda these two did not play against each other if biju had been number 1 then brinda and bridge would have played against each other that would have been the first match we know biju did not finish first now let's look at this chitra and dipen biju and dipen also played three games which dipen is also not number 1 because he loses in the semi finals so dipen plays against donna or deb wins that match plays against the other wins that match goes on to play against chitra loses that match it played three matches and not gone to the finals and so arun and chitra are semi finals which are ranked number 1 Biju and Dipen were semi-finals who were not originally ranked number one in their in their pots. Lovely. We made a bunch of inferences. Finals is between Aruna and Chitra, and Aruna won that one. Lovely. Who among the following is definitely not ranked first in his or her group? Aruna was wrong ranked first Chitra was ranked first Dipen was not ranked first Bridge could have been first we don't know that and uh, Dipen is not first that the answer choice C if Dipen had been first to qualify for the semi final he would have had to play only one game the semi final would have been his second game but he ended up playing three games that means he played one here and then one more then gone Which of the following pairs must have played against each other? Azul and Biju, no. Azul didn't qualify. Donna and Chetan, no. Donna didn't qualify. Deb and Donna. Dipen was not number one. So one of these two was number one. Dipen could have played against Donna, won, and then played against Deb. So Donna versus Deb need not have happened. Need not have happened. Right? Chitra and Dipen, yeah, that definitely happened. This is the answer. Choice D. Chitra and Dipen was one semi-final. who won the championship aruna won the championship who among the following did not play against chitra in the championship the chitra played against chetan dipen and aruna chetan dipen and aruna she did not play against bichu 